everyone, this is Jonathan Bates with foodforestfarm.com. Uh, I'm here at the um, Carbon Farm Project. Uh, we have a, a woodlot we're planting. Done a couple videos on uh, how we established it. Uh, we did some plowing and disking and cover cropping um, and mulching. And this year we are planting. So just a quick overview of what we've done here. Um, and kind of some of the species. So you can see here there are tubes uh, about every uh, 25, 30 feet across, um, off center from each other in each row. Uh, and so these tubes are protecting various uh, nut trees, some black walnut, some English walnut, some hickory, some um, honey locust, some chestnut, there are uh, three rows here, one, two, three, and then I'm just starting today on getting the last five rows in that are going down the hill there. Uh, slightly off contour, these rows have been um, designed to be slightly off contour to uh, be easy to collect water but uh, not um, pool water, and also they're uh, 14 feet or 18 feet on center, 14 feet between the rows of, uh, of the pasture. This is e makes it easy to manage with a tractor uh, mower. So here what you can see is the nut trees and in between, uh, right here, about every four feet is a black locust tree going across. There's between four and six black locust trees depending on the section. Um, been using a uh, uh, plastic landscape tarp to protect from weeds uh, and then this really nice six-foot tree tube um, with a, a screen on the top to protect from birds and rodents getting in and this is tall enough to keep the deer from nibbling on the uh, seedling that's growing inside. Um, so that's Jonathan, foodforestfarm.com. This is our uh, carbon farm project here in Brooktondale, New York. Tree planting. This is about uh, mid-May. Have a good day.